Yay, the mail is here. Yes, yes, yes. All right, let me show you what I got. It's a good TTM day. It's one of my better ones. I uh, honestly have the best TTM that I have ever gotten in my life, and I don't know what I'll ever get a better one. So, when you see it, you may agree, you may not. I really don't care. I think it's the best TTM I ever got, and I'll show it to you in a minute. First thing I got today, Landon should like this. I think Henry will, too. Uh, this is one of those hero cards. <clears throat> um, I got it in an auction for two bucks. It is signed by... I've never heard of these guys, but that's okay. Max Angeli, Wayne Taylor, and Ricky Taylor. And uh, there it is. You can see it's signed in silver. And um, pretty cool. They're part of the Corvette team. And I thought that was pretty cool for two bucks. Why the hell not? This, this, this is honestly the best TTM. A lot of guys, I've seen, I, I know some of you have already gotten this guy. Um, I, I just, I, I couldn't resist and what a great story and what a great guy. Um, if I can be 92 years old and be in this guy's shape and do what he did, uh, is amazing. I don't know if any of you, if some of you may know about, uh, this guy, he ran out on the mound last year, 2016. He was 92 years old in his Navy outfit and he went to the mound in Seattle and he threw the ball from the mound, not from in front of the mound. And then he ran back to the dugout, and uh, it was inspiring. And I showed my kid, who's joining the Navy, and he thought it was really cool, too. So I wrote him a note, um, and he uh, sent the card back to me. And this is Mr. Burke Waldron. To my friends, CJ and Ted, CJ's my son, Burke Waldron, World War II, 1943 and 1946. And he also included, I thought this was pretty cool, a couple of pictures. He signed this one. And then he also uh, sent me this picture. He says his hat's on backwards, and he didn't wear a uniform, the regulation. He wore bell bottoms. Uh, Garrett, what would happen if you did that? I don't know if you're going to watch this, buddy, but uh, would love to know if you wore bell bottoms. <laughs> what would happen? Just wondering. And finally, he sent me this awesome note, and I'm going to read it to you because I think it's great. He said, uh, Dear Ted, hey, second letter from Chicopee, Mass. Would you know a family named Carlson? I don't, but that's okay. He said his grandson is in, in the Navy 13 years and he wants to stay. My boots were in Camp Farragut, Idaho. It's in the Great Lakes now. Um, this, this is cool to me. He said, uh, the pitch was the most exciting want of my life. 40,000 fans cheering. Wow. Even more exciting than skydiving at 90. This guy is my new hero. This guy is amazing. Um, just awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome return. There's nothing that can compare to that for me. So, anyways, let's move on here. Let me show you the... I'll show you a couple RTSs that I got. Uh, the first one is Mike Phipps. Don't know what the deal is. I've seen some people get them back. Got an RCA. It says insufficient address. I don't know. Anybody else sent to him, and that, I don't know why that's insufficient, but we'll give it a shot. We'll see what, what. I'll, I'll look it up again. Uh, and then this one, David Smith from the Steelers. I do have a new address, so if anybody wants it, there it is. I'll be sending that back out today. Um, now, the rest of my TTMs. I got quite a few. Um, first one, um, this one's a little weird. It's a little hard to see. Uh, I don't know. Interesting signature, but whatever. Um, this is UFC, former UFC. I think she's still fighting. Um, her uh, fighter. Um, she was pretty good. She still is pretty good. Um, on the top, she signed it to CJ. And then I guess that's her signature. And on the bottom there, Liz Carmouche. She's a pretty good fighter. So I got that. And then you, a lot of you guys have seen that I'm doing this project. I, uh, this is three out of four that I sent out. I've, I've, I have another card coming because I didn't have it. And I found another artist. Uh, this is the this is Super Bowl 9. 
Um, and it was done by Mr. Bot Forbes, and he signed that for me. So that is really cool. And then let's do some baseball. First one, anybody that watches my videos knows I like to do these rookie stars. I think I can get the other guy too, uh, but we'll see. Um, he signed this in pen. Uh, this guy, he, he was a pitcher for the Phillies. I think he pitched like three games, but that's okay. I, uh, I li like I said, I like getting these signed. Signed it in pen, Mr. Maury Stevens. So there we go. Um, and then I like this one. This is, uh, 1969 Tops. Um, and he inscribed it for me, uh, as part of the 1971 World Series Champs, like I asked him to. And he was a pretty good pitcher uh, for that team. Um, so there he is, Mr. Steve Blass. Came out really nice. And then uh, this is the second one of these I got signed like this. This is a 1965 Topps. Um, I, have, I have this little thing that I do if I find an old Seattle pilot... Or an original original style pilot, or an original expo, or original San Diego Padre. Excuse me. Um, I try to get them to inscribe that for me. Uh, this guy was an outfielder, and I believe he is. I want to say now he is an executive or a scout. I forget. Um, but um, he signed this 1965 tops, really nice and blue. Uh, came out really nice, and he put original expo. Mr. Ty Klein. So that's pretty cool. And the rest are football. I got a bunch of them. Uh, 1978 Tops. Um, and I believe... Did I get... Yes. So I have two of these. I think. Mm-hmm. So... Uh, if somebody would like one, they are up for grabs. Um, if you have, if there's any Baltimore Colts fans out there, uh, this guy was a pretty good defensive back uh, and kickoff returner um, for the Colts in the '70s, and it is Mr. Bruce Laird. So I also have that one. So, if anybody would like one of those, just ask, and I shall send it to you. Um, next two, two of two. Um, really good kicker. Really good kicker for a very, very long time. This first one is a 66, I believe, Leaf. Or, uh, not Leaf, Philadelphia. Um, 66 Philadelphia. Guy was a kicker for the St. Louis Cardinals, Mr. Jim Bakken. And he put four-time Pro Bowl, as I asked him to. And then the other one is the 73 Tops. And he signed it. Jim Bakken voted kicker of the decade, 60s and 70s. So that's pretty cool. And then I also have another... Two of two. Uh, this guy was part of the seventeen and O team, I believe, uh, for the uh, for the Dolphins. He didn't sign that for me, but that's okay. First one is a nineteen seventy five tops, Mister Jim Langer. That one came out really nice, and then I also have a nineteen seventy six tops of Mister Jim Langer. Then, let's see, um, this next guy was a Pittsburgh Steeler, and he wrote me this whole thing out, telling me about his Pro Bowls, and pros, All-Pro Squad, and Steelers MVP, and all of that, which is pretty cool, I like that, so this, is, uh, you just saw who it was, so that's just fine, this is a 1973 Tops, and he inscribed it as I asked, two-time Super Bowl champion, Mr. Andy Russell, Came out really nice. You know, some of these guys, they really do know how to sign, and he definitely does. Um, I like this one a lot. Um, 
This guy signs for everybody, always sends his business card. Somebody thought it was printed, uh, uh, stamped the other day, but it's always in a different spot, and this one is. And he also added his Hall of Fame 2017 inscription for me, which I had asked him for, which is really cool of him. Uh, Dallas Cowboys owner Jerry Jones. Came out really nice. I love that. And then I have another Indian, uh, another Baltimore Colt. Uh, this is a 1978 Tops. Um, not a bad linebacker. Mr. Ed Simonini. Sip. Sim. Simonini. Simonini. That's it. And let's see. Uh, this is a Buffalo Bills guy. This is a 1981 Tops. Guy was a safety. This one also came out really nice. It's signed it in black shoppy. Mr. Jeff Nixon. Came out really nice. Uh, I've seen a couple guys get this guy back today. Um, it's weird because the 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 penny sleeve looks like it's smudged, but I don't see a smudge on the on the card, which is which is good. Uh, this guy was a really good safety, really good player. Um, this came out really nice. Really, really nice. Mr. Duran Cherry. See the smudge on the top, but the signature is not smudged. So, I don't know. But came out really nice. Really good player. And the final one is a two of two. Uh, he was a kicker for a few teams. Um, happens to be that this one was with the Tampa Bay Bucks. Um, this one did look so, like it did smudge a little bit. Um, this is kicker Steve Christie, and that's an 81 Bowman, and then this is another 81 Bowman, that was his Pro Bowl card, and then this one, we have this one, he wrote Bucks. So that is my day today. Like I said, really, really happy with my day. Really happy with uh, the Burke, Burke Waldron. Um, that's just awesome. Just, just awesome for me. And uh, hope you, uh, hope you guys had a full mail day for Tuesday. As you can hear, I need a nap. Uh, I'm not gonna get one, but that's okay. And uh, tomorrow, hopefully, uh, I'll have a few things for you too. And we will talk to you. Have a great day.